Do you want to actually see what happens when I get ready for the show in the morning? Uh, dare okay. I say, yeah. Here we go. I'm the king of the world. Yes, I am the cupcake man today. People are giving us the strangest looks on the street right now. They don't know what's happening. So the trick is, oh my gosh. There you go. We didn't go viral though. We didn't go viral. <laughs> I think we might. We don't know who this John fella is, but this is a 1920s man. Good morning, sir. You're running along here on the beach seat. We're outside of Union City. Oh, so just threw a snowball at me. Donna, can you believe it's been 242 years since I wrote the Declaration of Independence? I remember it was a gorgeous day. <laughs> Kentucky Derby tomorrow, so we're doing our own jam derby on the streets of Chicago. And then by a no! Down the stretch they come. Wait, what did you just say? I said I should have worn a sports bra. <laughs> Any chance I can get on the bus today? No, I can't get on the bus with an animal. Wait, can you say hi to my mom too? What is your mom? Marsha. Marsha. Where's Marsha? She's right here. Right here. Marsha, yeah. you adorable person. She loves you. Are you proud of your son? Yeah. Look at him. He's standing here on the line. Amazing. Yeah. I... I'm going to see a lot of stars now, Marsha. Sure. You're you're okay with hearing some of those things that that reporter may have asked questions about? <laughs> It does, of course, because it doesn't matter. Yeah, you're right, no, exactly, so exactly. It, that's the whole thing. Your personal journey through Chicago politics, then to national politics, and of course, getting to know uh, the former president and his wife, it kind of culminates in this night in Chicago, in Grant Park, and the night of the election. I mean, is there even a way to put into words what that was no, like? No, and as you remember from the book, I was speechless, yeah. and so was he. Hi, Sonia. How are you doing? Oh, my God. We're we're from WCIU, and we have a Christmas tree for you here today. How y'all doing? Oh, you got a gorgeous family here. We want to make sure everyone has a wonderful holiday Christmas season. Three, two, one, and lit! Hey, there we go. Evil stands for artists breaking limits and expectations. Doing the show, and the audience is watching. People will love it. They love it. I know, of course, that you would trade it all to have Matthew back, but does it at least give you a sense of at least it was for something. It's, it's really not about Matt anymore, is it? Because today's world is not Matt's world. And when he finally did come out, he came to me over the phone. Judy had promised Matt on the phone that she wouldn't tell me. And as soon as he, she hung up, he told, she told me. <laughs> you know, like I tell people. I figure they all, mother, always mothers do always tell. Mothers always lie. Yeah, that's the, that's the thing. On the move, I'm watching out for potholes and puddles all morning long here. John Hanson's here. Wow. We have the pizza party. What's up, Carlos? I don't know. Yeah, it's really yeah, it's really it's it's Welcome to Chicago Food To Go. I'm your host, John Hanson. This show is all about supporting local restaurants, whether they're here in Chicago's neighborhoods or in the suburbs. Here we go. There's the first one. Down it goes. There it goes. And oh, he got it on the first try. You don't even need the other ones. You are our winner. Congratulations to Chris. He still wants to play. Dude, you already won. Come on down here. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, I get a hug. Yay. John versus Chef. This is John versus Chef, and I've walked into my own kitchen for no reason. Fresh mint. Apparently, mint comes in bushes. I thought it came in gum. Meat grilling, fire, and smoke. This is where I'm born to be. <laughs> Just a little bit of warm honey. Mm, a little bit for Papa Bear. Mm. Mm. What? Okay. Give me a vial. Let's Hi. play the game. You guys are ruining everything. You're not I. supposed to guess until you guess the letters. Okay. Here's I. Don't. You guys ruined the game. Oh, Don't God. have a new face. <laughs> oh, Come on. Come on. Come on. I love the chocolate. Look at that. Yeah. Smollett. 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 You know, you're adding a schmuh. It's a smuh. Oh, the guy who lies. Smollett. 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 Jesse. Jesse. Say Jesse. 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 <laughs> you, your first answer was fine. Oprah's the shit, but <laughs> Ellen is just, she's more about, I don't know. You should have stopped with Oprah's the <laughs> So, because that's when you were right, and then everything else after that was not right. Hey, Jacob, how you doing, buddy? How's it going? Okay, well, that sounds like fun. Ah, it keeps on rolling. The Larkin students show us just how windy it's going to be. So their hands are up, they're cheering, and it's a win! Are you a big cupcake fan? Yes, I love sweets. I'm a, I have, that's my fetish. I love cupcakes, icing, all types of flavors. So. You went deep there with your fetish, man, sweet. <laughs> oh, girl, okay. Keep it clean, we're a morning show. It's getting hot in here, so hot, so take off all your clothes. I just, 
You did fall! Gotta go! Here we go. We're live, Linda. Linda just asked what time this is on. It's on right now, baby. Here we go! That was awesome.